Drivers beware. Honolulu police say there's been a spike in the thefts of Kia and Hyundai automobiles since December. So how can owners prevent that? I spoke to experts to find out what you can do to protect your cars. It's a trend in auto theft that hit the mainland back in 2022 and recently reached Hawaii's shores. We're talking about the rise in Kia and Hyundai thefts. Since December, they make up 30% of all stolen cars in Honolulu, according to HPD. So basically, we've seen um, about 120 um, Kias and Hyundai is either stolen or there are attempts to steal them. Many of them are being taken from the Kalihi area. There's about 32% of those stolen vehicles came from the District 5 Kalihi area. And I think 50% uh, of, of the vehicles recovered was from Kalihi. According to Horikawa, the uptick in Kia thefts are likely linked to a viral social media post showing how to hack into the vehicles. In a statement, Aloha Kia's regional VP says customers can contact their closest service department to get the scheduled upgrades. Kia continues to take action to support customers in response to the situation created by criminals using methods of theft promoted and popularized on social media. They are working tirelessly to ensure all eligible vehicles are upgraded. To date, they've completed over 750 thousand software upgrades on Kias in the U.S. So what happens to Kia owners who haven't yet gotten the update? And what can they do to make sure their car isn't gone in 60 seconds? I met with a manager at AutoZone who says steering wheel locks can be an effective way to prevent car theft. Well, for like amateur thieves, um, kind of timing is everything. So if they don't have the time to take it off, they're not going to be able to, they're not going to have the confidence to actually steal your vehicle. They're just kind of, you know, leave it alone and try to get somebody else that doesn't have one of these. Morris says they're easy to use and cost between $26 and $52. And do you think that it's worth it? I believe it's worth it, especially if you want to you keep your, uh, your vehicle, your vehicle, and not have it end up on the side of the highway somewhere. Horikawa says HPD has arrested a number of juvenile suspects and believe some of the stolen Kias may have been used in recent smash and grabs. But he says the investigation is ongoing.